Hey guys, what is up? Goldglove here, and we are playing some Gears of War 3, a game of Torque Bow Tag. A lot of you guys left me some comments and said, Goldglove, we want to see you guys, or we want to see you uh, play this uh, this game type. So I uh, hopped into the playlist and I played a few games, and uh, I actually just hopped into uh, some player matches because I was just trying to get some gameplay. I didn't think it was that important. Um, so I actually joined into this game one round late, and the COG team is already up a round. Uh, so I tried to, I was like, alright, hopefully I can bring my team back, and I'll see what I can do. Uh, but I, I, I had a little bit of fun. I am not very good when it comes to torque bows. Uh, I mean, playing this game type, obviously, or this playlist, obviously, is going to help. Um, I do fairly decent with it in this game. Uh, but I, I noticed that you don't have a shotgun. All you have is uh, a smoke grenade, you spawn with a torque bow, and you have a pistol. And that is all you have, and every single one of the weapon pickups on the map is Torque Bow. So I, you'll see me try to switch to my shotguns, or my shotgun, because I'm so damn used to it. It's just kind of instinct. Uh, it's kind of muscle memory, just to press left on the D-pad and hopefully, and hope that my shotgun is there. And so you'll see me do that a few times when people are rushing me or something. Uh, I forget that I'm playing Torque Bow tag, uh, but I do, uh, I do pretty decent. I think I get one Torque Bow headshot in this game. That's kind of nice when a guy's trying to hide behind cover something like that uh, fail on saving my teammate right there but right here um, the thing is about this since there's no shotgun a lot of people try to rush you and smoke tag you and if you get tagged with a smoke uh, you'll automatically go down or not automatically it has to explode and then you'll go down but uh, if you tag someone with a smoke grenade it's pretty much an automatic uh, you know you, you win the little 1v1 battle uh, so you'll see me, I think I do end up smoke tagging somebody um, just because I don't have any torque bow ammo and there's nothing else I can do. So, um, but I didn't, I noticed that the torque bow ammo took a long time. I don't know if it actually respawns on the map. I don't know if the, I don't know, I, uh, you'll see me, I, I'm waiting, for, I'll wait for ammo a lot and right here's a headshot. Boom, that guy's rolling. Uh, but I tried to pick up some ammo, like waiting for it to respawn, but I don't know if it actually does. I never did see it respawn. So I don't know if you just... You have to use your pistol once they're, all the ammo on the map is gone and uh, all the ammo on the ground is gone. I have no idea. So you'll see me a few times kind of um, get stuck in a situation where I have to use the damn pistol. Uh, this might be one of the times I'm trying to... Oh, no, never mind. That's when I smoke tag the guy and I'm like, yep, automatic down. And I just run away and I get the easy, uh, easy kill. Uh, but I actually... J this is actually footage from my brand new capture card. I picked up a Black Magic Intensity Pro. Uh, and it's actually a PCI uh, card that goes into your computer, and it actually records in 1080p, but this is in 720p, and the main reason for that is uh, my computer right now is is a little iffy, and uh, I, don't, I don't think my computer can handle the file sizes that the 1080p uh, you know, re or resolution makes. I mean, already, just holy shit. Uh, this gameplay was like... A total of eight minutes long and the file size was like 6.5 gigs which is just ridiculous um, you know a 10 minutes 10 minutes with the PVR is a gig and this was eight minutes and it was six and a half gigs that just goes to show um, how big these file sizes are uh, I don't know if the quality is a, a huge noticeable difference the reason I bought this capture card mainly is to live stream and so uh, I may hook up my PVR to do other type of videos just because uh, it's not going to kill my hard drive as much and uh, but for live streams I will be using the black magic uh, but then again I, I think I'm going to be upgrading PCs I think I'm going to try to get a decent PC uh, to be able to live stream because my processor is kind of weak on the PC that I currently have uh, I need to get it like an i5 or an i7 or something. I have I have enough RAM, uh, you know, I mean, everything else is pretty decent, but when it comes to my processor, it's just a piece of shit. So I, I definitely got to uh, try to upgrade and get something else uh, so I can so I can have sexy 720p live streams for you guys. Because I was trying to live stream last night, and for those of you who are actually interested in watching live streams, I do upload a video uh, when I go live uh, over here, and it just links to my, uh, to my streaming channel. But if you guys want to actually get a head start, and you can actually go over there and follow it, it is Twitch TV or twitch.tv slash thegoldglove07. I will put the link down below in the description. But you guys can uh, make a username. You can follow. You can you know bookmark the page. Whatever you want to do, I don't care. Uh, but I'm going to be live streaming a lot more often because I got this Black Magic, and the quality is not superb. It's not super right now. 
Uh, but hopefully in a, in a couple weeks, maybe a month or two, I will have, uh, you know, that beautiful HD quality that you've seen on maybe uh, Optic Gaming's uh, live streams, you know, that Wiz and them do in the Optic House, or maybe even the MLG stream, you know, they have HD. So hopefully I will be there very, very shortly. Uh, some people just have amazing quality. Um, and uh, so I I'm super excited to do that. You know, I have a lot of fun live streaming. I think it's, a I think it's just an awesome uh, kind of side thing separate from videos. You know, I love doing my videos, I love commentating, I love, uh, you know, my series, my Let's Plays. Uh, but then again, I, sometimes I just like to play games and I don't really want to record and so I can, you know, just hop on. Uh, maybe I can do some live streaming of some competitive GD matches when it comes to Gears. You know, something, I don't know, It's it all depends what you guys want to see. Uh, but uh, back to this whole Torque Bow Tag thing. Uh, be sure to leave me a comment and let me know if you guys are enjoying this uh, Torque Bow Tag. Uh, it's not really for me just because I'm not a huge fan of the Torque Bow. I mean, yeah, it's fun to, to you know, mess around with. But I like just the classic, uh, you know, just regular uh, play, play style. I don't, I don't need a uh, Torque Bow only playlist. That's not really one that pertains to me. Uh, but I did hear a rumor, and I got this from John, Johnny B. He told me that they are coming out with a kind of like a retro old school playlist where apparently it's just going to be Lancers and uh, it might just be Lancers and Nashers, but it might also be uh, Lancer, Hammerburst, and Nasher. I'm not exactly sure how they're going to go about that, but it's basically a playlist. I don't know if it's just going to be a weekend long thing or it's just going to be kind of classic. There's not going to be any sawed offs or retros. Uh, and they might take out some other weapons as well. I don't know. There probably won't be any digger if it's a retro playlist. So they'll probably have boom shot, sniper, and torque bow, pretty much as the power weapons. Um, so yeah, I'm super, I'm super excited to see that in Hammer of Dawn, obviously, because that's from Gears One. Uh, but I'm super excited to see that playlist. I think that'll be kind of fun. So uh, be sure to leave me a comment. Let me know if that's actually true, because uh, I just heard it from John. I don't know. I, I mean, I believe in John. I think <laughs> I trust John. I believe in him. Uh, but you know, I just in case. But anyways, uh, I ended up dying right there, and my team actually does end up losing. Uh, but I'm not gonna make you guys watch my team sit back and camp. So thanks for watching, guys. Be sure to give the video a like if you enjoyed, and uh, hopefully I see you guys on Gears of War 3. Bye.